This is the Tech Phantom showing you how to take on every boss in Dark Souls with the washing pole. Um, I've made a plus 10 washing pole and I'm going to take on Quaylag. She's actually a very very difficult boss so you need to know the strategy to fight her otherwise this boss fight can be very very difficult and you may die several times. So the strategy here is to stay to the side of Quaylag or away from Quaylag as she spews lava and to take pot shots at her. Quaylag will attack with a uh, three hit combo with the Fury Sword and the third hit in the combo actually has quite a bit of range and if you get hit by it you don't have enough vitality you'll probably die and she will also prompt the spider that she's riding to uh, either spew lava or do an area of effect attack and one of the area of effect attacks is, is quite powerful so the strategy is to be very mindful of the lava and go to the side and when the spider spews lava take a couple of shots there is the very powerful area of effect attack that you need to be uh, very careful of um, when uh, Quaylag is swinging her sword you can either stand just to the left of her and she will miss you or as I did you can uh, roll to your left. Um, the timing is a little bit tricky but once you get it actually the fight is not that difficult. Or you can do what I've been doing here which is to um, back away when she swings her sword, wait until she does her third attack and then rush in um, uh, for, a, uh, for a strong attack or a normal attack. So um, I have a plus 10 a fire, um, standard washing pole that I'm, you're able to do that after finishing the uh, Capper Demon and you're able to get into the, the depths and get the, uh, uh, the Ember to make a plus 10 pole. Uh, it's doing 252 damage. I also buffed it with the Gold Pine Resin. I'm wearing the Stone Set, I'm wearing the Dark Wood Green Ring and the Rusted Iron Ring I just left on for that fight. So that was the uh, Dark Souls uh, Quaylag boss fight with the washing pole. Enjoy this video and others in the series.